Looking for a superior breakfast sausage? From vegan to poultry to pork, it's difficult to know which is best to start your day. Of the top 15 sausage brands, here's how they rank. Most of us only interface with Butterball when we're buying a whole turkey for Thanksgiving. However, the brand offers a variety of turkey products that you can eat throughout the year, including this log of loose breakfast sausage meat. If our experience is anything to go by, the company should stick to slinging whole birds. You'll be wary of this sausage opening the tube. It smells like gamey turkey with very little evident seasoning. The texture is also disturbingly loose, more like a meat paste than a traditional breakfast sausage. The resulting mouthfeel is both mushy and foamy, two adjectives that rarely apply to appetizing food. It's almost like the interior of a chicken nugget that's managed to escape the crispy breading. Despite the fine grind of the butterball turkey sausage, there's still some tiny pieces of gristle scattered throughout. I don't know. Give it a try. The flavor doesn't help make up for the lackluster texture. The lack of seasoning tastes more like a turkey burger than a sausage. This is being sold at a steep discount at our local store, and we can see why. In addition to selling grocery store products, Bob Evans is a chain of casual dining restaurants that are slowly disappearing from the American landscape. We can't say we're surprised based on the brand's preformed pork sausage patties. Of course, these patties are stamped out by a machine, so we won't dock too many points for aesthetics. The texture is pasty and excessively soft, and the sausage patties are under-seasoned. There isn't any distinct herb or spice flavors, and they have too much sugar for our taste. Also, there isn't a strong taste of pork either. The limp flavor combined with the uniform texture makes these feel too much like sliced hot dogs. The Smithfield spicy sausage tastes excellent, and we love that it has a distinctly more cured, salty, hammy flavor than most of the other sausages. The spicy element comes in the form of red pepper flakes that add the perfect amount of heat without overwhelming the classic breakfast sausage seasoning profile. There's just enough pork fat in the mix to lend the sausage a strong, meaty flavor. So if it tastes great, why is it at the end of the list? It's undone by its rough texture, and even worse, it is among the most grisly sausages we've tried. We really wish the texture was better, because Smithfield's flavor would put it in the upper echelon of this list. Frankly, it's hard to chew and hurts our jaws. This casing-free pork sausage link comes out of the package looking like straight pork fat flecked with tiny pieces of meat, and its looks aren't deceiving. When you put these on the stove to be cooked up, it releases an incredible amount of rendered fat into the pan. Biting into a link will send pork fat shooting into your mouth. It tends to coat your palate, numbing other flavors and making it difficult to detect any other components. It's also difficult to taste other parts of your breakfast with these. If you're having Farmland Original Pork Links for breakfast, you're having them for the rest of the day. These Farmland sausages taste like lard, with few noticeable flavors besides salt. As a standalone breakfast side dish, these are pretty overwhelming. They're so rich that it's difficult to finish even one link, and probably better as an ingredient alongside other components. The Light Life was our least favorite of the plant-based sausages we've tried. It emerges from its tube appearing unappealing and gray. Once it's cooked, it nails the consistency of a real meat sausage, minus the unappetizing gristle. It is slightly bouncy, yet tender, and thankfully not mushy at all. It wouldn't convince anybody that it was real meat, but it would perform well in classic sausage dishes like biscuits and gravy or breakfast sandwiches. The taste leaves something to be desired, though. The first thing you'll notice is something extra sharp in the seasoning profile, perhaps a little too much black pepper. There's also a strong fake meat flavor that the seasoning can't overcome. It tasted like plant protein, most likely because of the soy protein used to make it. There's also a bitter aftertaste that lingers. These frozen pre-cooked sausage links have some great attributes. They brown up nicely and look appetizing. The pork flavor comes through prominently, they're well-seasoned, and they stay juicy even after being heated up in the oven. The banquet links are also not very grisly, which is nice. As a convenient breakfast side, they work pretty well. However, they have some unappealing characteristics. The worst part is their foamy texture. In addition to pork, these sausages contain both mechanically separated turkey and soy protein concentrate. Jenny O is another turkey specialist with a poultry-based breakfast sausage, and its offering blows Butterball out of the water. This product has none of the textural deficiencies of its competitors and boasts a tight and coarse consistency that is reminiscent of a good pork sausage. The seasoning mix in Jenny O sausage is also excellent, with plenty of salt, pepper, and sage. A little rosemary extract provides an additional herbal kick. The Jenny O seasoning blend applied to pork sausage would be amazing, but this product has a gamey turkey aftertaste. Nevertheless, it's still pretty tasty, and if you're looking to buy loose sausage and want to avoid pork, this isn't a bad option. Of the three vegetarian sausages on this list, Morningstar Farms tries the least to approximate real meat. 
as long as it tastes good. Not every vegetarian meat substitute needs to go for perfect replication. But, according to comments on the company's website, the recipe has changed for the worse. The old version isn't on this list, but the new version is pretty tasty. These look better than any of the meat-based preformed sausage patties and have a rustic, pebbly exterior that browns well when cooked. They taste like grain, which is probably due to the wheat gluten included in the recipe. There's also a hint of ginger or some other sweet spice in them, which threw us off a little bit. Nonetheless, they are preferred as far as veggie options go. Applegate Naturals makes a wide selection of frozen meat products without using the chemicals and preservatives that you might find in less expensive brands. It also raises its animals without antibiotics and claims to employ humane farming practices. As such, this brand might be a good choice for people concerned about animal welfare or who have a preference for natural foods. Taste-wise, this chicken and maple sausage has a nice black pepper kick. The mouthfeel strikes the proper balance between tenderness and bite, and you can taste real chicken. That makes you wonder about a lot of things. Uh, you, you take chicken, for example, maybe they couldn't figure out what to make chicken taste like, which is why chicken tastes like everything. However, we found these chicken sausages to be a little sweet for us. The product description on the Applegate website suggests that these could be a substitute for pancakes in the morning. They contain sugar, maple syrup, and maple sugar, which combine to give them a candy-like sweetness. On the plus side, as their namesake boasts, the flavor of real maple syrup comes through. When you close your eyes and imagine a classic breakfast sausage, a one-pound roll of Jimmy Dean might pop into your mind. For many of us, it's the stuff we've enjoyed our whole lives, crumbled into gravy, next to pancakes, and slapped onto breakfast sandwiches. The contrast in textures from other sausages is quite noticeable. While the Smithfield sausage is tough, Jimmy Dean is soft, tender, and juicy. It has one of the best mouthfeels of any of the pork sausages on this list. The flavor, sadly, is a little muted. We recommend opting for the spicy version to get an extra kick. The seasoning is lacking, and the meat is a tad too sweet. Swager Tea's Farm Sausages has a reassuringly short ingredient list. Pork, water, salt, spices, sugar, and no MSG. And you can tell, these definitely taste like a premium choice. A different seasoning profile is present compared to many of the other breakfast sausage brands. There's less herbal character and sweetness, but instead, these patties lean towards more savory flavors. You can taste onion and garlic powder, which is a welcome addition to the mix. The minimal amount of sugar works well, as it allows the meaty taste of the pork to shine through. The texture is nice and firm without being tough, although there might be a few small pieces of gristle. Not only is the Jones brand great for a turkey sausage, it's so flavorful it's difficult to tell it isn't pork sausage. It's also an excellent pre-cooked frozen link, making it both tasty and convenient. It's pre-browned and looks great after being warmed up. This brand uses a ton of sage. The company doesn't use mechanically separated meat, so the links have a nice texture compared to some of the cheaper sausage brands. There's just a touch of sweetness, which balances well with everything else going on flavor-wise. This is a top recommendation over any other poultry sausage. Impossible Foods plant-based ground beef products have been quite impressive in general, so we had high hopes for this sausage made from plants. But upon opening the container, it doesn't look very appealing. Bad first impression aside, something magical happens to this sausage when it is cooked. It firms up and takes on an appearance that is indistinguishable from traditional pork sausage. One bite confirms the eye test. This stuff really tastes and feels like actual sausage. Johnsonville Original Breakfast Sausage Links differentiate themselves from the competition in a couple of ways. For one, these are the only links that come wrapped in casings. Even though the casings are collagen rather than natural intestine, they still added a pleasant snappiness to the texture. Although the meat is finely ground, it is held in tightly by the casings so it doesn't feel mushy. In addition to the casing, the other unique aspect of the Johnsonville links is their seasoning mix. Among the many premium breakfast sausages on this list, which are flavored with variations on the same spice blend, the spices in these links really stand out. They don't taste much like herbs or black pepper, but instead lean towards sweeter spices. It's not exactly clear what specific seasonings are in there, but you can taste hints of ginger along with mace and maybe nutmeg. These spices play well with the pork and make for a delicious sausage that is different from the norm. The only reason these aren't in the top spot is because they might disappoint someone who's looking for the basic, classic breakfast sausage experience. For the best straightforward, classic breakfast sausage with no twists or modern innovations, we recommend Farmer John. These skinless links are fatty enough to deliver serious pork flavor, but not so fatty that they're overwhelmed with the flavor of lard. The meat is very coarsely ground, which gives it a satisfying chew, but it's still quite tender and succulent too. It delivers the perfect mix of typical breakfast sausage seasonings, herbs, black pepper, and salt. And there is just enough sugar to balance the savory side without making the sausage a pork-flavored dessert. 
Even though this isn't one of the all-natural brands, Farmer John's Sausage doesn't have mechanically separated meat or fillers, so you know it's high quality. Even better, it's one of the least expensive brands out there. What could be better than that? A half-pound box can cost only $2 at your local supermarket. As for classic pork breakfast sausages, you can't go wrong with Farmer John at your breakfast table. I'll have what I'm having!